and welcome to another episode on the Mind Rocking SMP. So today is going to be a fun day. Um, we're in my hole. Um, now, I'm not certain if this is going to be particularly conical with the last episode or not, because this has been sort of shot simultaneously. But one of the guys on the server, uh, a particular Mr. Boom MC, um, put a call out wanting a bin. Uh, he needed a trash can. He wanted to empty to destroy a load of just random stuff that he'd got. And so he put a call out for someone to volunteer to build him a bin. And he wanted a bit of a flash bin. Now, I don't know how well Boom knows me. But I like building overly complicated and overly engineered redstone contraptions. So I volunteered to build Boom a bin. And this is what we're going to do today. Um, so I've gone round and I've got myself a few supplies. So we have my redstone supplies. Pretty much all of this is going in Boom's bin. Um, this gives you an idea of... We're not talking your normal Minecraft trash can. Um, and then we also have some building blocks to uh, get it built with. Um, so yeah, we're going to go have some fun. Let's go and find out where Boom wants his bin. And uh, we'll actually sort of go in there and we'll show you what we're going to do. Well, here we are. Um, we are now over in Boom's uh, nether area. Um, so he's got quite a large nether mining operation going here. Um, and I can see that he has already accumulated a whole host of shulkers full of netherrack. And as we are officially still early game, um, shulkers are still hard to get our hands on. And so I'm guessing that's why he wants this big bin to get everything sorted. So he did tell me he wanted the bin sorted somewhere around here. Um, now I know he's done a little bit of work here, but what we're going to do is I'm going to create not just one bin. It's actually going to be two. Um, so we're going to do a traditional trash can, um, although guru Um, so it's going to be the fastest trash can you've ever seen. Um, and then we're also going to do a trash can for shulkers. Um, so what that will do is that will empty the shulker, bin the contents, and then return the shulker back to boom. Um, that's the plan. Um, I'm going to get on with one of them to begin with, so I'm probably going to do the trash can first. Ooh, scary, spooky, sparkly eyes. Um, so yeah, we'll get the uh, trash can done first, and then we'll come back and we'll show you how that works, and then we will go in with the, um, the shulker unloading trash can in a moment. Okay then, so we've prepped the hole for the first part of our trash can. Um, so what we're going to do is we are going to increase this wall just here. And over here. Um, we now need our droppers. And we're going to place one, two, three, four. And one, two, three, four. Uh, we are now going to take some lava buckets um, and again all of this is overkill I understand this this is the whole point of what we are doing is overkill uh, so we're going to fill all of those up let's swap this lot over and we're going to fill all of this lot up Uh, we can now grab our glass so that I don't die. And we will just... I uh, don't have silk touch yet, do I? Oh, well. Cover all of that lot over so we are now nice and safe. Um... Now, what we want in the middle is we need some target blocks. Let's get rid of my buckets. And we want some redstone torches. So we go target block, target block. We go redstone torch, 
we go. Redstone torch. Um, on this side, we want a target block here. And on this side, we want a target block there. We now need repeaters and comparators. So we go comparator, repeater. Switch you to subtract mode. I don't have my redstone dust. Uh, da, 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 da. Redstone dust. And we dust. That, that, and that. And we go the same again here. We go comparator on subtract mode. We go repeater. We go redstone dust. Um, I can actually block all of that lot in. And we can block all of that lot in. Now what we need to do is we need some hoppers. So we go hopper into the top of each of these. And we do the same over here. And then we do another run of hoppers into here. And we do... Oh! The same... Over there. If we come over here, we want a hopper into each of those. Right, so, so far, I got a run of 12 hoppers, but these four and these four each go into each of the uh, droppers that are directly below them. Although these ones are slid across, it goes across and then goes down, whereas these ones just go down. Um, so, next job, I need some iron bars. And the iron bars, we run in a little L shape, a little C shape, right the way around there. We'll then grab ourselves a couple of rails, and we put a rail down there and there. And then we'll grab ourselves two Harper minecarts. And we whack one on there, and we rack one on there. And then we can break that rail and that rail. And we just nudge these into these corners. So that one can go all the way in there. That one can go all the way in there. So far, so good. Um, now I need another. Uh, so I'm going to want glass on that level. So I'm going to want, before I go too much further... Uh, give me some random blocks. Netherrack will be perfect. Let's pop these two torches. Oh, say goodbye to the torches. Um, so I want glass there. We want pistons there. So I want those there. And then let us grab, not that one, that one. Uh, eight pistons. And we basically just go piston down, piston down, piston down, piston down, piston down. Piston down, piston down, and piston down. Perfect. Uh, let me staircase up to here and remove all of those. Uh, we put redstone dust on all of that. Give me a block. Um, do I have any actual just flat wood? No. So let's grab a log, uh, wood, and a button. Uh, 
Check out button on there. Check out redstone dust on there. Um, give me a torch. Give me a little bit of light so I can see what's going on. Let's force all of these into the corners again. Now we grab our No, we're gonna lose all of these because there's no way I'm getting these back now, unfortunately. We destroy our iron bars. Two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight glass. And now when we hit this button. There we go. We have two minecarts perfectly located in the center of eight um, hoppers. No, two hopper minecarts perfectly located in the center of eight hoppers. Um, I go there and there. That's better. So yeah, if we chuck now, I can never act. They go pretty quick. All right then. So there's your trash can boom. Um, this is as basic as it's gonna get. Um. Pretty simple trash can, all things entitled, but just the biggest and fastest you will ever see, I do believe. Once again, we'll go another stack of Neverack. Gun. You can run through quite a bit through there. Now, that's not the only job. Next, we have my shulker shell, my shulker unloader. We're going to get on with that in a moment. Um, I need to clear out a little bit of room behind this thing to get that in because we're going to do a little sort of... Whoa! Big face! Um, we're going to do a little bit of a, uh, a different thing here. Um, so what we're going to do is we're going to clear out some room and then we shall see you in a moment when we get it all sorted. Okay, so we have cleared out the room that we need for this monstrosity. So the first thing we need to do, um, we want... Our two droppers facing in to our lava. And uh, we're going to drop a block up there. And we are going to protect my bum so I don't get toasty. I don't want that block there. So that's the, um, the lava in to begin with. Let's get the mechanism in for getting these to work. So we want... Uh, let's get rid of the buckets. And some redstone dust. So we take a comparator out of there and there. We then hit those into a repeater. We then put those into two target blocks. We then take that all the way down there and go into another target block and hit that to subtract. And again, all the way down here into your target block and that one subtract. So now again, anytime anything goes into either of these droppers, it will immediately get kicked out into the lava and get killed. So there's that side of things done, actually. Let's do this properly. We don't put redstone on blocks. Because otherwise they can get killed. We brick. I would normally use wool. However... I don't have enough coloured wall at this precise moment in time and I have a whole host of cobbled deep slate which is why everything's being built on deep slate. So let's just put these back in now. One, two. One, two. One, two, three. One, two, three. There we go. So that's our actual destroy mechanic. Now we need to get items out of a shulker 
into this so next job we take is we take two hoppers and we go a hopper into there and a hopper into there um we now this is based on uh Rafe's shulker unloader now Rafe's shulker unloader was a a standard shulker unloader and i want to go a little bit extra so i'm doubling the speed on his shulker unloader um the way that i'm going to do that is by using hopper minecart again um so what we do is we place two activator rails i'm going to need a temporary block or two right about there and there um do, 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 do. We're going to want a normal block there. Um, and we will put a normal block up there. And another one there. So, what we do now, I don't have a hopper minecart. Uh, so, pass me some iron. There we go. Uh, give me a minecart and a hopper minecart and this is where my boat comes in so what you do is you place your hopper minecart there you step back a touch and you grab your boat and you drop your boat there we now move that bow and i can now knock that in there um i need a chest uh, so we want a couple of lumps of spruce give me a chest this chest is just a temporary chest and there we go that's about perfect that is being emptied out of there and going double speed out of there so now we can destroy our boat we can destroy our chest they'll both get popped out of there i don't really mind too much about that that is that section done um now what we need to do we need to come back here and we go block block be something to run up we jump over here we grab a repeater and some dust and we go repeater and dust on there um we got a block there that needs a comparator on it We then crouch, place a block there with a torch on the back end of it. So what this section does is our we're gonna dispense our shulkers on here onto this block. They're then gonna get emptied by the hopper minecart whilst the hop that that is empty either a shulker's empty or there's nothing there this hopper minecart's actually locked because of the activator rails so the second that anything that it reads this comparator reads anything inside a chest that will be there or a shulker that will be there this turns off which unlocks which um turns this unpowers this block which then turns off the activator rails which means that this can then pull everything out once that's pulled everything out and it's empty, this will then lock again. We will then fire a piston, killing the shulker, and that will go into a hopper that is going to be right here. In fact, let's get that hopper in right now. Um, actually, I want another block. there 
I want my hopper to go there. We want to break that hopper. And we want that hopper into there. And I can then break that. That's going to be for the collection system later on. Right, so we've got my hopper collection system in. We've got my sh shulker emptying system and my shulker collection system. Next, we need the shulker dispensing system. And so for that, um, we go up another block there. That's going to be where I need to go. So we want to go here, up here, up here. Um, up you, you, you. I need, I didn't bring what I needed. Give me two seconds, guys. Someone's been a fool. I don't bring, I haven't brought any dispensers with me. Two minutes, I need you back. Right, we are back and we have dispensers. So, we have a dispenser firing down right there. That's what we need. Um, I'm going to want to have a hop up in that side. Um, we want to break you and you. No, we don't. I wanted that back. Never mind. You, 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 you come back over here, I need a comparator, that way, that's the badger, I need observers. Dink, da dink, da dink. We have one. With the bum facing me, right about there. Need a little spot of dust. On there. Now then, over here, we have. I want a piston there. So if I grab you and go you and you I want a sticky piston facing down there destroy both of those we want Block there. I want to come around here. I want a normal piston going sideways off this block. We want. Block there with a repeater. Going into that block, and then I want another observer. In that way, I can tidy some of this up. Last thing that I need to do is twofold. Give me you. We want torch on there. 
And then we need three dust on there. I believe we are done. I will need to clean up. But what I'm going to do... I'm going to... Give me another chest. Chest. No, let us pick all of my redstone back in here. Done, 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 done. Cool. Um, I'm gonna put all of my building blocks out of this. into here right and uh, we will grab all my spare neverack spare neverack can go in here and this is where we run my test so in theory what is supposed to happen is we put shulkers into this Hopper. They go into there. That gets read by this comparator, which starts the system off. It will then activate and pop um, the shulker through the dispenser. It will then get emptied by the hopper minecart, and all of that will get, blown, uh, get destroyed. Once that's done and this realizes it's done, it will fire the system, which will then pop the shulker. After locking these tracks, the shulker will end up over here and come out of this hopper here. And if there is a second shulker, that will then be dispensed. Here goes nothing. We have a shulker. Everything's being blown up. Shulker got destroyed. And he's in there. Woohoo! <laughs> it worked! So, that is my shulker unloader bin. Not in its final form, however. So, bear with me. I'm going to do the rest of this off camera. And I'll come back in a moment and we'll show you how everything else is going to go ahead. Right then, we are done. So, um, this is the most overly engineered bin in the face of Minecraft. Um, plain and simple. So, what we have here. Um, you saw my shulker unloader bin. Um, yeah, I made another eight. So, this will now have nine shulker unloaders in it. Um, reason being, no one wants to wait around while multiple shulkers unload, and if you un unload the area, then it's going to stop. You're not going to get your shulkers back. What's the point in that? So, um, let me uh, do this, and we can show you it working. We take a shulker, we're going to drop some Neverack. Now, I'm an early game noob, so I don't have that many shulkers. So, what we're going to do is I am going to steal some of Boom's shulkers that are here. Uh, we're going to take three of Boom's. We're gonna pop that one, we're gonna pop that one, and we're gonna pop that one, and we're gonna pop my one, make sure it's the right one. I don't want to throw away all my uh, redstone components. So what you do, just walk over here, you open the chest, you go one, two, three, four. Four shulkers, all with a stack, and never rack in them. We hit the button, and away it goes. We can come through to the door, and we can have a look. So as you can see, each one of these gets loaded into the shulker loader. That LAN sends off the minecart to go and collect them all. Um, now, each one of these, basically what will happen is if there's anything in this hopper, which is where the shulkers will come from, 
it will then fire off this minecart to come and collect it. So, and then, you know, it doesn't matter if there's going to be a long length of time. You know, one of them's got a full shulker. One of them's only got a couple of items in it. They will all run at the same time. And then we have all four of our empty shulkers back in the case. So that one's mine. And these three are booms. So there you go, boom. Hopefully you like your slightly over-engineered, slightly over-engineered build um, and your over-engineered trash can with the fastest standard trash can and one of the fastest shulker unloaded bins I think I've seen in a long time. So, uh, yeah. Uh, thanks for watching. Um, this is going to be a little bit longer of an episode than I would normally do because of the, the amount of... Uh, building that's in it um so thanks if you're still watching all of this and we shall see you again soon bye